a weight, Charlie. It's a nicer one. Oh, it's a big bath, bud. We are back doing our annual family vacation in Crane Lake in northern Minnesota on a Voyager houseboat. The kids are having a ball. We got a big group of them, some teenagers and a bunch of 12-year-olds. And we're out doing some fishing for multi-species action here in Voyagers National Park. My son Thomas is helping his buddy Charlie there with a real nice smallmouth to start us out. We're talking smallmouth bass, walleye fishing, and enjoying a summer family vacation on a Voyager houseboat. This is a fun segment, stay tuned. You know, this is a world-class bass fishery up here. Lots of size, lots of numbers. It's another nice one. Yeah, that's a big one too. We're catching them all different sizes. This morning before we headed out after breakfast, the kids were all casting from shore. They're just catching little bank runners, little peanuts, but they were having a ball. Now we're out in the main lake here and the boys are fishing. We've got a, some orange worms on. We're throwing topwaters, jerk baits, catching bass all different ways. It's such easy fishing up here. It makes a, a family fishing vacation on a houseboat a really fun time. That's what Crane Lake's all about right there. Nice one, buddy. Thank you. Let her go. You know, Charlie and Thomas and I are tag teaming them. We've got worms, we've got topwater lures, and we've got jerk baits to cover the little bit of the deeper edges. We're also targeting fish in different moods, right? Topwater fish are aggressive, jerk bait fish, those will trigger strikes from fish, and then those worms are for the fish that are a little more neutral. It's a beauty, Thomas. Get a couple pictures. Oh, nice fish, Charlie. Another one, one with it, another one with it, another one with it. Oh, you got one with them? Yeah, hold up. Sometimes you'll have bass follow. The one that's hooked, looking for some. Oh, that's a big one that followed him, followed him man. Look at that. Do that. Keep him in the water there for a second. Charlie Thomas, help him with that one, all right? That's a beauty there, Charlie. That's a photo fish. You're getting some big ones on this trip, huh? Personal best a couple of times. There you hit that little purple desk and skitter pop. Nice fish, Charlie. Grab him. Nice topwater fish. Good job. Nice big one. You know, we're having a lot of fun catching fish up here. We've got kind of a fishing centric group of kids with us, so that's been our focus. But so much more to do on a Voyager houseboat than just the fishing. Of course, you've got the swimming here in the beautiful lakes of Voyagers National Park. The houseboats have slides on the back. Some of them have hot tubs on the roof so the kids can go and jump in the cool lake and then jump in the hot tub to warm up. We brought a kayak along on this trip so the kids have been paddling around in that and even fishing off of it. We're gonna be doing some rock climbing and cliff jumping during this trip. So there's some beautiful cliffs that you can leap off of into this water up here as well. And if you like to bring along tubes or jet skis or water skis, you can certainly do that as well on a Voyager houseboat. So lots of water fun as well as great fishing when you do this type of vacation. Ooh, that's a big one, Thomas. Yeah, that's a nice one. Does he got one with him? Yeah, I saw one behind him. You know, I just, I saw these while we were dealing with our last fish and I just tossed the worm up behind the boat and got one. Oh, that's another big one, Thomas. Another nice one. Another worm fish. The Voyager fleet consists of 34 boats between 36 and 60 feet with varying levels of amenities. All of the boats have gas grills, water slides, full kitchens with all the cookware and utensils provided, microwaves and stoves, refrigerators, and of course hot and cold running water and hot showers. Some of the more upscale boats even have generators, air conditioning, and hot tubs on the roof. Jim and Gretchen Jansen and their staff will take excellent care of you during your trip in Voyager's National Park on a houseboat. Oh, nice, Thomas. The worm is treating you well. Yeah, getting some success with it. Pull it on me. A bigger fish. Jump again. There you go. Oh yeah. You know, pretty easy fishing up here for the kids. A lot of shallow fish. Windy days. There's all kinds of bays and islands you can tuck out of, so you can always find some comfortable areas to fish. Easy to cast to them. You know, top waters for bass are really fun. It's kind of a visual experience for the kids. You like to bring kids fish and avoid your houseboat is a great place to do it. What an incredible trip this year. We've had kids that have caught their first walleye, their first smallmouth bass, 
and the biggest fish of their lifetime. If you'd like to experience spectacular Voyagers National Park with your family and friends, give Jim and Gretchen Jansen a call at 1-800-88-BOATS or go to houseboatvacation.com to start planning your trip to northern Minnesota. Along with producer Josh Burlett, I'm Roger Cormier with my family and friends. We'll be right back with more Midwest Outdoors!